So we're at um, Stone Mountain State Park. It is a brisk 45 degrees. Beautiful day. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? I'll see if you yell at me for trying to take your drink again. Yeah, right, dude. Um, if you don't know what Stone Mountain is, it's a pretty legit mountain. It looks really cool. It's like the closest thing to Yosemite out here. It's nothing like Yosemite, but it's pretty cool. It's a big rock, and we're about to go hike it. Are you excited? Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. So, cool thing, um, we're about to go check out this uh, waterfall. It's a 200 foot waterfall. It's a pretty tall waterfall. A lot of it is just kind of a, uh, well, I'll show you here. Kind of just, uh, you see. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> What the heck, dude? Dude! Oh my gosh, I got that on footage. <laughs> Wait, uh. I went to tell you there's ice. <laughs> Holy crap! My ass I'm is dying, soaked dude. now, dude. Oh my gosh. Look at this. What the heck is this? Bro, I didn't even notice that was ice. Dang, blab, bro. Anyways, what I was saying is, this waterfall, most of it, it's just this like sliding down the rock kind of thing. But it does get pretty cool the more you go down there. The only thing that sucks about like me busting it is my ass is soaked and it's like cold frozen water on my ass cheeks. But other than that, that was freaking hilarious. I luckily did not get hurt at all. I think my backpack saved me and that was just hilarious. It's supposed to be like a peaceful video, but whatever. So this is part of the waterfall. Pretty freaking sick. I do say so myself. You guys butt sweat because you busted it. It's it's drying off pretty fast. It's toasty down there. So I ain't ever seen this waterfall. I don't think. I've been here like before, but I was like five years old. Bros, we just found like the biggest pine tree in the freaking world. Probably not the world. Oh like, yeah, I ain't never seen a pine tree this big, John. We were just like walking and we like look up, we're like, Dude! Big hunk right here. Look how big this is. So it got to the point where I had to take the jacket off. Now I got my just the dude in the woods shirt on. Made it myself. I mean, I'm just a dude in the woods. But cool thing is, is we're actually getting pretty close because you can see Stone Mountain. I don't know if you guys see it, but that big ass rock right there, that's it. <sighs> Holy crap, man. It's bigger than I remember, dude. So I think I actually see somebody rock climbing here because I think they do rock climbing. But my goodness, dude. <laughs> A little bit of history on this place, from what I know, is they're not really sure on how it formed, but what they think happened is, is when this land was forming and all these mountains were forming, magma was pressurized from underneath and it blew up the surface like a big bubble, like bubble gum. And it made, it made that. That's Stone Mountain. And you can see way up there, people rock climbing. Right, we found some weird shack. It's like a 200 year old shack. I don't know 
Oh, no. Oh. Well, this is it. I mean, I guess you could climb up there if you really wanted to, but I mean, why is this just blocked off over here? Yeah, there's like a village. You got that building, you got that building, that building, that building. Apparently, supposedly, this was an actual like town or something settlement back in the Dizze in like the 1800s. Pretty cool. Imagine you're like a settlement in the 1800s. And like you just stumble upon this. And you're like, you know what? I'm this gonna build a house right here. Yeah, I'm gonna build my house right here. This is sick. Man, I tell you what, I thought Hanging Rock had a lot of uh, stairs, but I mean, dang. Like, this has been the whole climb up almost. We're almost to the top now. <sighs> Just hiking up. A rock, a big ass rock. Really cool landscape up here, man. Now we got some wooded section here. It's a little bit of a nicer step here. A little ramp action. Getting pretty close now. Hey, how are you? Good thing I didn't do leg day yesterday. <laughs> Absolutely. Amazing, bro. I run a sub 35k, and this this is a workout. Jeez. So, uh, a spot like this deserves a cliff bar review, okay? Well, I guess it's not a review, it's just a, a cliff bar session, because I've already ate this one. Mm -hmm. We hungry. No trees is like an awesome view, but also it's kind of bad, because like if you drop something, it's just gonna keep tumbling, and it's probably not gonna stop until it hits the bottom of the mountain. So, <laughs> gotta keep that in mind. I got my tripod set up pretty firm, so I'm not too worried about that. I mean, the oatmeal, Raisins and, and walnuts, again, it's just a classic. Really good cliff bar. I'm gonna enjoy this, and we're gonna go explore the top of the mountain. By the way, reporting on my pants, um, my butt's not as wet. It's not soaked, but it's still damp. Another little view right here and walk off there. This is an awesome place for like a picnic or like you're just hanging out for the day because there's so many cool views. Like so many little like pull offs. Like I don't know how to explain it. Like you know, like little rock faces like out there right here. And they all have like super cool views. Levi, check this out. Huh? You got a view of the mountain. Oh, yeah, that's sick. So there. That's where we were, over there. Dang. That's Storm Mountain, boys.
I really thoroughly enjoyed this mountain. Pretty freaking sick, man. Did you like it? I thought it was freaking sick. Yeah, dude, it was pretty cool. It's got like the little town a long time ago. Yeah. That little town. And, like, can you imagine that, just waking up and looking up to a mountain, you know? I don't know, like, who's like the person that like just stumbled upon this? Like, it's so different than most mountains in North Carolina, you know? You don't find this really anywhere around here. So, very nice spot. It's good to come back here after years. I mean, like, last time I was here, I was like five years old or something, so. Yeah, for me, this is the first time I've ever been here, so. Yeah. It's pretty nice. The trails aren't bad. They're pretty, like, smooth, and they give you, like, stairs and stuff when you need them. Yeah. So it ain't that bad. Luckily, we were all safe on the hike, except for the time that I ate it. Ready for my next adventure, which is tomorrow, so. Let's, uh. Let's do that, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. Don't click off the video yet. All right, I got something to tell you. I know the video is already at like 14 minutes or something like that, and I said that I was gonna do another adventure the day after what you just watched, and I did. Uh, I went mountain biking, and I have a lot of footage from that day, but I'm not gonna put it in this video. I'm just gonna ask you guys if you want to see something like that. I have a lot of footage. Me and my brother went mountain biking, and we had a good time, but I just wanted to let you guys know that that's why like, I didn't do an outro right there, and yeah, I wanna know if you guys want to see me do mountain biking i'm not really sure if you guys are like into that if so then i'll put it as next week's video or i might just throw it up randomly as like a bonus video i don't know anyways this is gonna be the outro right here i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did you can leave a like that would be awesome you can comment and you can subscribe if you really want to and do all that jazz i will see you guys in the next adventure peace out and live cosmic just do the sun <laughs> <laughs> right in my back.